Our book today is called Red and Yellow's Noisy Night by Josh Selig. It's about two friends who live together in a tree and they have, they're having a problem and they need to figure out how to work around this problem so they can keep being friends. Now, this is not a book that I'm going to sing. It's not like most of the books that we do. It doesn't rhyme, so I'm just going to tell the story. And uh, let's see what happens with these two friends. I hope they can stay friends. This is red. This is yellow. I don't know exactly what they are, but they're kind of cute. They live happily together in the branches of the olive tree. But some days they live more happily than others, like when Red fell into the flower pot. One night, Yellow was getting ready for bed when there was a loud noise. It was Red playing his strummy. That's what they call that instrument there. And that makes sense because on a guitar or ukulele, you strum the strings. So he has an instrument called a strummy. I'm sleeping, Yellow said to Red. You see, he got out of bed and brought his pillow with him. You don't look like you're sleeping, Red said to Yellow. Well, I'd like to be sleeping, Yellow said to Red. Oh, said Red. So Yellow was kind of hoping he'd get the hint that the strummy was too loud. Well, that he did. And Red went back to playing his strummy more loudly than before. Stop playing your strummy so I can sleep, said Yellow. And Red was also upset. Well, stop trying to sleep so I can play my strummy, said Red. Hmm. Both friends are upset now. They weren't getting anywhere. Yep, they each wanted something different and neither was going to give in. There's Red with his trummy. Red began playing a quieter tune on his strummy. So he was not as loud as before. Yellow liked it. Red liked it too. Hmm. So he didn't have to stop playing, he just played something different. Then they both had a wonderful idea which happens sometimes. How do their faces look? Yeah, they both look happy now. Red played his strummy very sweetly for Yellow. The sounds of Red's strummy helped Yellow fall asleep. Oh, that was nice, sort of like a lullaby or nap time music. Wow. And everything was good in the olive tree once again. The end. I'm so glad that those two good friends could work out their problem. Red and yellow's noisy night.